Hiya, Michael here with a very quick video about why you should not buy the Casio FX85GT CW, a calculator that's new for 2024. So let's have a look at this very typical GCSE physics question. We've got a weight of one newton hanging on a spring and it extends by four millimetres and the question asks us to find the spring constant normally well always written as k so here's our formula k equals f over x f is of course the weight so putting numbers in it's one divided by x x is here it's the extension and we need it in meters so it's four times ten to the negative three and when you work that through the answer is 250 newtons per meter okay let's have a look at what some casio calculators give here's an old calculator probably around about 15 years old and you can see it's 1 divided by 4 to the negative 3 and there's your answer 250 okay let's have a look at another calculator this one is probably about eight years old same calculation same answer okay here's a lovely 991 this is probably three or four years old it's the same calculation you can see it here and of course it gives you the same answer now let's have a look at the new Casio calculator here it is you can see we've got exactly the same calculation one divided by four times ten to the negative three and look at the answer it gives completely wrong and that i think is unforgivable in an up-to-date calculator now there are a couple of workarounds so let's have a look at those here's the first workaround if i put the four times ten to the negative three in brackets it gives me the correct answer the old calculators put those brackets in automatically another workaround is to do it as a fraction there you go same calculation but this time written as 1 over 4 times 10 to the negative 3 and it gives the correct answer but my contention is that the modern calculator should do everything that the old one did plus more stuff this one fails